guys welcome back again to another world war ii uh, got you another map um got some sniper play coming up this one is saint mary du mont uh, it's all right board it's okay a lot of people go right to that map that house right there and all they do is camp inside it that's the back side of the house and um uh, it kind of gets annoying after a while because everybody just migrates. I don't know what the deal. I guess because it's the biggest house to get in. There's like 14 houses in this map to get in and out of. So why they pick the one in the center is beyond me. But they love that house right there. And that's the back side of it. So you'll see them and you'll see me. I'm running the mountain or actually expeditionary because I was trying to level it up. Because now I figured out uh, to get trip mines, uh, re, I guess, re-get them again. And the way to do that is to rock Expeditionary and have it on the fourth level. Oh, there's a trip mine kill. So, yeah, man. And with that Expeditionary class, it will replace your uh trip my it'll replace your lethal and tactical from a dead an enemy's dead body so got done up and uh on this one i'm rocking the uh, type 100 with extended mags reticle quick grip and grip i believe i got like three attachments two or three attachments there's also a um basic training that will allow you to uh, have three attachments on your weapon i was hoping that was the enemy and they're all going to be up in this house the way to play this is just go around the outsides of the map if you have a trip mine it's good to set it right there next to that stairway or right by this door because they steadily coming in through that area oh i had to let go of him teammate man you sat there and watched it we get we got some randoms on our team man that just i don't know what they're doing they watching people drop shot huh make it easier to hit that head right here watch how i go up the stairs by the time i get up here there'll be somebody set off that boom trip mine i love those little bouncing baddies man they're super fun I hope you guys are enjoying the World War II game. I, I really enjoy it. Boots on the ground. You know, it's tactical. Don't get as many kills in TDMs, I noticed. Even some of the better players we've been playing with and against, they're not getting those 40, 50 game plays, and neither am I. So, But that's okay. This is a different style of Call of Duty, and, you know, you just get got to get acclimated to it. I love these uh, frag gr I mean those um, stun grenades. Look at it. That's a good placement. They come around that bus and they walk right into it. But yeah, it does replace it. You know, um, I was thinking that it wouldn't because the next game I got in and got frags, and it was replacing the frags every time I ran over a dead body. But um, I really wasn't paying attention what what you know to the enemy. But it does replace your trip mines. So expeditionary on the fourth level will allow you to have, well, third, I think, allows you to have a lethal and a tactical. And then, or se the second level, I'm sorry. The third level is you, it allows you to put down the uh, trip mines and, uh, trip, uh, trip mines and the uh, flash grenades. Uh, lets you pull them out and throw them faster and further. And then uh, on the fourth level it lets you basically resupply your lethal and tactical trip mine there go on up these stairs again rinse and repeat boom yeah that's probably the best place i've found to put those trip mines they have to i think not use their lethal and tactical to re-scavenge them because I've noticed after I go over a couple people, um, after I go over a couple people, some people have already thrown their grenades and it won't let you scavenge from it. So it has to be uh, an enemy 
that hasn't used their lethal or whatever when you go over it. Now, they don't have to have a tactical. Man, that pistol. Ugh. Shot me through the wall. Man. And I get people sending me invites and party chats and stuff like that. And sometimes I have to either A, mute them or uh, sometimes, you know, it's uh, they're sending me invites and I'm trying to accept them. So I apologize for the my screen bouncing up like that. Taking it to them. Bink. See, what happens if I hear that thing getting a kill, then I know there's someone up in there. Or not kill, I should say, a hit marker. And if I get a hit marker, whoop, dolphin dive, huh? They call it hit the deck, but it looks like a dolphin dive. And especially if they're running and then they dive. Ooh, bad shooting, get over here. It's a close game. I mean, we're not, it's 42 to 38, so it's a close one. I like this left side on the outside right here. Usually you can catch them coming out of their spawn right there. And uh, that's a good little area. That I, I shot and, see, and I don't have silencer because I'm not rock, rocking airborne, uh, like I said, so you, you know, it's unsilenced. Where are you going, fella? Back over here. If you get a hit, if you get shot, you would think he would have turned around, but he I, he thought he could just outrun it, I guess. Now, like I said, it's going to be a learning curve, but the more we play this game, the more you get used to the routes, uh, the more you get used to using the equipment. I got to pick up that trip mine. I want to place it somewhere else. You'll get better and better and better with it. Uh, each and every game, each and every time, you should feel like, oop, hide, hide, hide. This guy gave me a challenge, man. Turn up. <clears throat> I like playing against good people because it pushes your skill level to the limit. I'll put that trip mine in there. In case they try to come in through the other side. EPSH, extendos, that's kind of what I like to run. I like to run quick grip and extendos on my PPSH. This gun here kind of has some properties of a assault rifle, meaning it's good pretty much long range, and the recoil is real manageable. So I find myself really enjoying the Type 100. I know in the beta, I love the Type 100. It was my favorite sub in, in the uh, beta. But, um, man, the PPSH does a lot of good for me, so I've been using it a lot. These dudes are all up in this house. And that's another thing. They, oop. I do a little camping from here and there, but, man, I don't stay in the... In the um, I don't stay in the... Um, in the one area the whole game you see i'm moving around guys yes i do camp and i like to camp to me camping is strategy and i know a lot of people think it's for people who don't have good skill they camp because they can't you know stay alive any other way but for me it's a little different it allows me to slow slow the pace of the game up just a tad trip mine there and then it um it allows me to get score streaks. Check this sniper shot out, guys. Pick up this sniper rifle. Now I'm wounded. Watch this. Pop. See ya. That's all I need that sniper rifle for. And I got the trip mine kill. Cherry on top. Double kill. Victory, guys. We ended up doing all right. Shout out to all the players on my team, Tex. Um, I'll call them out if I see them on this next one. I did see Tex was playing with me on this one. There you go. Good play. Good play. World War II. I enjoy this game, guys. I'm going to bring y'all some sniper play here really soon. It ain't going to be a lot of kills. So we got Tex, Boss. And da, 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 da. I think that's it. Tex and Boss was running with me. Shout out to you two guys, and I appreciate y'all for helping me out. 
on time i'm out